The Super Eagles of Nigeria, after winning their first game at the African Nations Cup against Burundi by go to nil, will face the Sili National of Guinea in their second fixture at the, at the Alexandria Stadium in Alexandria. Now, let's look at this game, Nigeria-Guinea. Over the time in history, Nigeria have played Guinea 17 times. Nigeria have won five, lost five, and drew seven. So you can see it is balanced between the, the, the two countries. None is better than the other in terms of head-to-head. -head. But now let's look at the Nations Cup proper, how both teams fared in their first games. Nigeria beat Burundi by a goal to nil. A very interesting, difficult game. Burundi fought very hard, created most of the chances in the first half, but succumbed to a beautiful pass by Ola, you know, and an exquisite finish by Jude Odion Igalo. Now, Guinea on the other hand, played against Madagascar on paper, the weakest team of the group, but couldn't beat Guinea, Madagascar. And the game ended 2 all. It was a surprise to so many people, but again, that is the hallmark of the African Nations Cup. Now, Guinea, Nigeria, this promises to be very, very exciting, keenly contested for and KG, the Guineans would want to put up a good fight against Nigeria, having drawn their first game. Nigeria, on their own part, showed some flashes in the first game, but I think that the coach learned some lessons that he would want to correct in the match against Guinea. I wouldn't want to go into all of those tactical jargons. That is left for the coach, Genotoa, to handle. Now, Nigeria-Guinea seems to be a game that will be very tough, a game that will be very cagey, a game that will be very tight. But Nigeria, on paper, has got a slight edge. Jude Joy Gallo will play from the start. Team. I think he will play from the start in this one. And of course, being the top scorer in the qualifiers is a man that you must always look up to for Nigeria. So it's going to be a tough game. Um, but I think that Nigeria would win. Now, let's talk about punting. Let's talk about betting. If you want to put your money, I would say that put your money on a straight win for Nigeria, but under 2.5. Straight win for Nigeria plus under 2.5 because this one looks very tight. Nigeria would slightly win, but I don't think that there will be up to three goals in this one. So once again, I say a straight win for Nigeria plus under 2.5.